Our Chairman, Your Excellencies, uh, distinguished ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Our country needs a new constitution. That appears to be a consensus here. How to go about it? We've been told also. What we need to do now is carry on and have it happen. I'm a simple infantry general. We run a military government, our military era. We set in motion policies and laws we believe will make the country a better country. We handed a 1999 constitution to our people. Today, it is absolutely clear that it's not working for the good of Nigeria. Therefore, therefore, I hear you all saying here, set that aside, correct the mistakes, and move our country forward. Our governor in Lagos State has given his commitment to join in this procedure. And I believe our president, who himself is a fighter for democracy, I recall way, way back then when he and a few others were first out, out of this country in exile. They returned in 1999, became governor of Lagos State, and continued the fight for deregulation, more parts of the state, autonomy, and so on. Now, as president of Nigeria, we need, we need to aid him to join in that chain. Reason why? He swore May 29 to defend this constitution. But so, the way to give him the pardon to begin to change that is for the National Assembly, that is the people's authority, to rule Nigeria, to pass that uh, law into which he will sign onto, and giving him that support, he, I believe, the president will join in making this change. Lastly, no state in Nigeria, I repeat, no state in Nigeria is insolvent. I hear some economists say so, and, and I say to them, why are you saying this kind of thing? Every state in this country is viable. But I don't expect a civil servant in Kano that has more money than Abia State to earn the same salary. Abia State should develop based on what they have, as Kano would do it. So also, Lagos State would develop at her own space. And somebody in Jigawa State wouldn't earn less, but they will run their services, run their based on the revenues available to them. That's the way to run a federation. And the federal government would then support states that I, that I need, either in loan or in grant, to do what they have to do. But we need to decentralize, give the states more authority, and have our zones, all states, as a federation unit. <laughs> Lastly, I want to beg of you to rise with me, to remember the founding members of this a patriot, Chief F.R.A. Williams, Chief Abraham Adesanya, Chief Barayike, Dr. Faiso Kibo, Professor uh, uh, Joey Ruku, Alhaji Ganyu Daudu. Please rub with me and remember them because without their thought and their vision, we won't be talking as patriots. May their thoughts rest in perfect peace. Thank you.